Well, social media and other companies are collecting more data on us about our online habits than ever before. News Tens Laney Miller tells us how you can protect yourself from data breaches on social media. Being private on social media means keeping your profile private from other users, not the company itself. Apps are constantly collecting data from our activities online, so your private information can be made public without you even knowing it. They have a lot of information about you and what scammers do is target those companies and try to get into their systems and breach into their data to get all of the consumers information that they have on file. Social media sites like Facebook are filing your personal information from app tracking to location history. You agree to share your personal information when accepting the app's privacy settings. The privacy protection or um, the settings that you may have on your account or what the business promises when you sign up for you know an account on their platform. You know, that is what's in place, but that doesn't mean that scammers can't potentially, you know, hack through that and get beyond it. And in some instances, you know, businesses may sell consumers information. So if, if that's happening, of course, you would want to know that before you sign up for an account with them. Avoid oversharing online. Hackers get information directly from you when you share personal information on social media, like those quizzes you can take on Facebook. A lot of times you'll see on social media these quizzes about the, you know, the street you grew up on and your first pet's name. Well, if you remember, a lot of times when you set up an account, they may ask some security questions in case you don't remember your password down the road. And a lot of times those quizzes are set up with what would be the same information, the street you grew up on, your first pet's name. So if they would try to access your account, maybe they have your email address, they're not sure of the password, and they go to reset it, and they ask these questions that you just put in a social media quiz, they would have the answers to that and potentially be able to change your password without your knowledge. Protecting your privacy on social media is critical. It's one step you should take today. Lainey Miller, KLFY News 10.